looking for an easy and creative home workout using only house items. Today, we're going to explore a world where your living room transforms into your personal fitness studio, where everyday items become your workout gear, and where you, yes you, become your own personal trainer. Welcome to this innovative fitness journey that's all about making the most of what you have around you. From that sturdy chair in your dining room, to the thick hard-bound book on your shelf, you'll be surprised at how these everyday items can be used for an effective and enjoyable workout. We're not talking about boring, repetitive exercises here. Oh no! This home workout is designed to be as diverse and dynamic as any gym routine. It's a perfect blend of strength training, cardio, and core exercises. So whether you're looking to lose weight, tone up, or simply stay active, this routine has got you covered. The best part? No special equipment is required. You don't need to worry about expensive gym memberships or fancy workout gear. All you need is a little bit of space, a good dose of determination, and a few household items. But don't be fooled. While this workout may be easy on your wallet, it's designed to challenge your body. We've included exercises that target different muscle groups, ensuring a balanced and comprehensive workout. So expect to feel that burn, expect to break a sweat, and most importantly, expect to have fun. Remember, the goal here is not just to work out, but to enjoy the process, to appreciate the strength and capabilities of your body, to celebrate each drop of sweat as a testament to your efforts, and to emerge stronger, healthier, and more confident. So, are you ready to transform your home into your workout space? Are you ready to discover how everyday items can become your fitness tools? Are you ready to embark on this exciting fitness journey? Stay tuned as we dive into this fun and innovative fitness routine. Before we start, remember, warming up is essential. Now why is that? Warming up prepares your body for the workout ahead. It increases your heart rate, delivering more oxygen and nutrients to your muscles. This process enhances their performance and reduces the risk of injuries. Plus, it mentally primes you for the exercise routine, boosting your focus and determination. So, what are some simple warm-up exercises you can do at home? Marching in place is a great start. It's straightforward and gets your blood pumping. Aim for around 5 minutes, gradually increasing your pace. Next, consider climbing your stairs. It's fantastic for working your legs and ramping up your heart rate. Just be cautious and maintain a steady pace to avoid any missteps. Remember, the goal of a warm-up is not to exhaust you, but to wake your body up. It's about getting ready for the main event, your workout. Now that we're warmed up, let's jump into our first exercise. Strength training is a key player in weight loss, and you don't need a gym to do it. Ladies and gentlemen, let's dive right into how you can turn your home into a personal gym with everyday household items. These strength training exercises aim to work various muscle groups, and the best part is, you can do them while watching your favorite show or listening to a podcast. First off, let's grab a couple of water bottles. Yes, you heard that right. Water bottles. These will be our makeshift dumbbells. If you find them too light, feel free to fill them up with sand or pebbles. You can do bicep curls, tricep extensions, or lateral raises with these. Aim for three sets of 15 reps each, and trust me, by the end of it, your arms will be on fire. Next up, we're going to make use of a sturdy chair for tricep dips and step-ups. For the tricep dips, position your hands shoulder-width apart on the chair, extend your legs out in front of you and lower your body until your arms form a 90-degree angle. Then push back up, aim for three sets of 12 to 15 reps. For the step-ups, simply step onto the chair with one foot, then the other, and step down. Repeat this 15 times for three sets. This exercise is great for your quads and glutes. Now let's get creative with a towel. Yes, a simple bath towel can be a great resistance tool. Hold it taut with both hands, and with your feet shoulder-width apart, perform a series of squats. The tension in the towel will force your upper body to work harder, making the squats more effective. Aim for three sets of 12 to 15 reps. Lastly, let's not forget about our core. For this, we'll need a thick book. Think an old dictionary or an encyclopedia. Lie down on your back, hold the book above your chest, and perform a series of crunches. The extra weight will make the crunches more challenging, and your abs will thank you later. Again, aim for three sets of 12 to 15 reps. Remember, the key to effective strength training is maintaining proper form and control, not speed. So, take your time to perform each exercise correctly and don't forget to hydrate. By incorporating these exercises into your routine, you're not only working towards weight loss, but also improving your overall health and fitness. Plus, you're saving time and money by not having to commute to the gym or invest in expensive equipment. 
In the end, it's all about making the most of what you have and staying consistent. So get creative, have fun, and start sweating. Remember, consistency is key, so keep at it. Cardio exercises help you burn calories and improve heart health. That's right, friends. All you need is a little bit of space, and you're ready to get that heart rate up. Let's dive into some simple yet effective cardio exercises that you can do right in your living room. First, we have the classic jumping jacks. This is a full body workout that gets your blood pumping and your muscles firing. Start by standing tall with your feet together and arms at your sides. Then, jump your feet apart and swing your arms above your head in one swift movement. Reverse the action and repeat. Aim for a minute of jumping jacks, but remember, the goal is to keep moving. Next up, high knees. This exercise is like running in place but with an extra kick. Stand upright, pull your right knee towards your chest, and then quickly switch to your left knee. Keep alternating your knees, pulling them as high as you can. Try to maintain a brisk pace. High knees are great for building strength in your lower body and boosting your heart rate. Now let's keep the momentum going with burpees. This is a full body exercise that combines a squat, push up, and jump into one powerful movement. Start in a standing position, drop into a squat, kick your feet back into a push-up position, return to the squat, and finish with a jump. It's challenging, yes, but it's an excellent way to raise your heart rate and burn those calories. Moving on, we have mountain climbers. This exercise targets your core while also providing a cardio workout. Start in a plank position, pull your right knee toward your chest, then quickly switch and pull your left knee toward your chest. Keep alternating knees as if you're running up a mountain. Remember to keep your core engaged and maintain a steady pace. Lastly, we've got the spot jogging or running in place. It's just like running, but you're staying in one spot. Lift your feet off the ground one at a time, just as if you're running. Keep your hands relaxed and pump your arms in rhythm with your steps. You can do this at a slow pace for a low intensity workout or speed it up for a high intensity burst. Remember, the key to effective cardio workouts is maintaining a consistent rhythm and keeping your body moving. So, keep that energy up. And don't forget to hydrate. Taking small sips of water between exercises will keep you refreshed and fueled. These exercises are not just about burning calories or losing weight. They're about improving your cardiovascular health, boosting your mood, and increasing your overall energy levels. So, whether it's early in the morning or late in the evening, get up, get moving, and get that heart rate up. Feel your heart rate up? That's the magic of cardio. So, keep the momentum going and remember every step you take is a step towards a healthier, fitter you. A strong core is essential for overall fitness. It's the foundation for almost all movements, whether you're lifting groceries or running a marathon. So, let's dive into the world of core strengthening exercises that you can do right at home, using only a mat or carpet. First on our list is the classic plank. This exercise works your entire core and it's as simple as it gets. Begin by positioning yourself as if you're about to do a push-up. Rest your weight on your forearms and toes, keeping your body in a straight line from your shoulders to your ankles. Brace your core and hold this position for as long as you can. Aim for 30 seconds to start with and gradually increase as your strength improves. Next up, we have the faithful sit-up, a staple in any core strengthening routine. To start, lie down on your back, bend your legs and plant your feet on the ground hip width apart, cross your hands on your chest, inhale, brace your core, and lift your body up towards your knees, exhaling as you go. Lower yourself back down, inhaling as you do. That's one rep. Try for 10 to 15 reps to start and work your way up. Now let's ride into our next exercise, the bicycle crunch. This exercise is great for those obliques, the muscles on the sides of your abdomen. Start by lying flat on your back, hands gently cradling your head. Bring your knees in towards your chest and lift your shoulder blades off the ground. Now pretend you're pedaling a bicycle. Touch your right elbow to your left knee, then your left elbow to your right knee. Keep alternating in a smooth pedaling motion. Aim for a set of 20 to start with and increase as you get stronger. Consistency is key in core training, as it is in all aspects of fitness. Aim to incorporate these exercises into your routine three to four times a week. And remember, it's not about speed, but rather the quality of the movement. Slow, controlled movements are the way to go. Also, it's worth noting that a strong core isn't just about flat abs. It can improve your balance and stability, reduce back pain, and even enhance your performance in other sports or physical activities. So, while you're working on creating that six-pack, know that you're also contributing to your overall health and fitness. Lastly, 
Be patient with yourself. Core strength doesn't develop overnight. It takes time and consistency. But with each plank, each sit-up, each bicycle crunch, you're getting stronger. And that's something to be proud of. Keep pushing and you'll see those abs in no time. Remember, fitness is a journey, not a destination. So enjoy the process, celebrate your progress and keep moving forward. You're doing great. Now that we've worked up a sweat, it's time to cool down. Cooling down after a workout is just as vital as the workout itself. It helps your heart rate and breathing gradually return to normal and can help prevent dizziness or fainting. Plus, cooling down can also prepare your muscles for the next workout session by reducing post-workout soreness and stiffness. So how do you cool down effectively? Start with some light cardio, like walking around your living room or lightly jogging in place for a few minutes. This helps to lower your heart rate slowly. Next, it's time to stretch. Stretching post-workout helps to increase your flexibility and reduce tension in your muscles. Try some simple stretches such as a forward fold to stretch your hamstrings, a chest stretch to open up your upper body, and a butterfly stretch for your inner thighs. Remember, a good cool down can help prevent injuries and speed up recovery. So don't skip this crucial part of your workout routine. Well done on completing the workout. Let's recap what we've done today. In our journey today, we first warmed up our bodies, preparing our muscles for the workout ahead. This step is crucial to minimize the risk of injury and to increase our performance in the following exercises. Next, we jumped into strength training using household items. We performed squats, deadlifts, bench press, lat pulldowns, and shoulder press using items found right at home, like water bottles, canned goods, and even our own body weight. This creative approach not only added an element of fun to our routine, but it also demonstrated how accessible and versatile strength training can be, even without a gym. We then moved on to cardiovascular exercises, jumping rope, doing high-intensity interval training on a stationary bike, and performing a variety of core exercises like planks, Russian twists, and leg raises. These exercises help to improve our heart health, increase our endurance and burn calories, aiding in weight loss. Lastly, we cooled down, stretching our muscles to aid in recovery and reduce muscle soreness. This step is just as important as the workout itself as it helps to prevent injury and improves flexibility. Throughout this fitness routine, we targeted all major muscle groups, including our core, which is essential for good posture and overall strength. We also incorporated both strength training and cardio exercises, which are key components of a well-rounded fitness routine. The benefits of this fitness routine are plentiful. It aids in weight loss by helping us burn calories and build muscle, which increases our metabolic rate. It improves our strength, endurance, and cardiovascular health. Plus, it's convenient. We can do it right at home, using only household items. No need for expensive gym memberships or fancy equipment. Remember, fitness is a journey, not a destination. So keep moving, stay consistent, and enjoy the process. That's it for today's workout. We hope you enjoyed this at-home fitness routine and found it as fun as we did. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Your likes help us reach more people who could benefit from these workouts. If you haven't already, we encourage you to subscribe to our channel. We regularly post fitness content, and subscribing ensures you won't miss any of our upcoming videos. We also value your feedback. If you have any thoughts, questions, or suggestions about the workout we did today or any future workouts you'd like to see, please leave them in the comment section below. We read every comment and your input helps us create content that best suits your needs. Remember, every step, no matter how small, is progress. Thank you for joining us today. Keep moving, stay consistent, and enjoy your fitness journey. Until next time.